Hi everyone, it's Yvonne from the Somerset County Library System again, and today I wanted to introduce you to another important member of my household. I name all my modes of transportation, and this here is my kayak, Aya. Aya means island in Icelandic. You probably know the word without knowing it, that lovely volcano that went off and disrupted air travel all those many years ago was Ayafjallajoka, and that means the island's mountain glacier. So there you go, you now know how to say one word, maybe two, in Icelandic. So this is Aya Island. Uh, she's named Island because she's a sturdy vessel. She will not sink. However, she steers about as well as you would think an island would. But I love her anyway because she is my boat. So things to keep in mind when you're kayaking that you may not have thought of. I think everybody thinks, oh, I need a kayak, I need a paddle, I need a life preserver. I'm set. And unfortunately, no. You need to make sure you have the proper permits. Depending on where you're going, you need some sort of boat launch permit. I'm actually licensed to launch in Pennsylvania as well as Round Valley Reservoir. You do need to have a boat ramp permit to go there. Most places in New Jersey you don't, but just check before you go. Better safe than sorry. Another thing that's really important to have that you may not have known of is a whistle. <laughs> if you are going to be on a personal watercraft in the state of Pennsylvania or the state of Florida, you need to have an operative, operating whistle on your person so you can call for help this way if you need to. And it's actually a really brilliant idea, so I suggest you do it, even paddling around New Jersey. Another thing you need, water shoes of some sort. Most of your kayak launches, you're going to be launching right into the water, so walking in with your boat. And that's also where a lot of people go fishing. So you don't want a fish hook in your foot right when you're getting started. Um, as you can tell, Sean, big fan of sitting in the kayak. He sleeps here a lot of times during the day in the summer. Uh, other things you need, water, very important. Sunscreen, always important when you're in the outside. If you can, get a dry bag. So you can put your license, all your important information in here. And if in an emergency something does happen, like it gets really windy or the water does come over top, which happened to me just last week, your stuff will stay dry in your dry bag. Um, I also remember these very styling fanny pack. Yeah. So I'm always wearing a fanny pack in my boat because this is where I keep my camera and I keep everything in Ziploc bags because, you know, water. Finally, uh, this is something I only recommend if there's going to be, the lake is busy, meaning there's definitely other people around. One of my favorite things to do in the summer is go night kayaking. So I set out probably an hour before sunset until about an hour after sunset, and I kayak in that. Those conditions, I adore it. It is amazing. Uh, oh, checking out my life preserver. Um, so... <laughs> You want to make sure you have lights. Um, I have these very bright lights. I had fixed them to the back of my life preserver so I don't get run over by a boat. Uh, the other thing that you can do is wear a headlamp, but keep it on red. So headlamps come with this red setting. What's great about that is if you are with a group and somebody turns around to look at you, you have not taken away their night vision. You will not blind them but it gives you a little bit of, you know, you can see a little bit, but really it's just so other people see you. So that is my, my kayaking spiel. Uh, it is a wonderful hobby. I absolutely adore it. Uh, I can't wait to get back on the water again, and I will be out soon, hopefully, hopefully very soon. And uh, happy reading. You read about kayaking and get all prepared and see places to go. Uh, and also, happy getting outdoors. Enjoy your local parks. Enjoy your local water. Get outside this weekend. All right. Have a good one, everyone.